Hi, I'm Cliff Hildreth, and as always, I'd like to thank you for taking the time to check out my video. Home not selling? Figuring out why the exact reason your home isn't selling can be a difficult task if you have a list of reasons working against you. The fact of the matter is, you can't simply place a for sale sign in your front yard or have your real estate agent add your listing to the MLS and expect the home to sell. There's a fine art that's applied to every home sale and the home must be appealing to buyers from presentation to price. Have you placed your home for sale only to watch it go stale on the market? Here are five of the most common reasons why homes don't sell and some of these could very well be why your home isn't selling. Number one, and this is number one, the home is overpriced. Listing a home over market value is one of the main reasons a home doesn't sell. Listing your home at a price that's appropriate for the current market conditions from the start is crucial since your home will have the most activity as soon as it hits the market. Therefore, if you intend on listing at an unreasonable price, you'll be missing out on the best opportunity to make a sale. Don't make this common mistake. Number two, the presentation is off. Have you ever gone into a messy home and immediately wanted to leave? The same rules apply when buyers visit and if your house fits the bill, then I can assure you this is one of the reasons why your home isn't selling. Give the home a thorough cleaning and make sure the home is properly staged before placing it on the market. Number three, ineffective marketing tactics. Advertisements for your home should be placed everywhere. They need to be found on all the major websites that potential buyers frequent. Mailers should be sent out to surrounding communities along with emails to area agents and other potential buyers. And there should also be a comprehensive social media campaign including Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and other national and international sharing sites targeting the specific buyers that would be qualified to purchase your home. The whole nine yards. If this hasn't been done, then it's no wonder your home isn't selling. Not enough people know it's for sale. Number four, poor condition. While some people don't mind a fun fixer-upper, nobody wants a complete dump. If your home appears to be one of the latter, it may be why the home isn't selling. If the home is just in need of a new paint job, maybe carpeting, why not take care of that? You may also want to weigh the option of making other necessary repairs in order to get the home sold. And finally, number five, not listening. Finding out why your home isn't selling is as simple as following up with a buyer after a showing and your agent should have some sort of real estate feedback system in place to make sure you know what buyers think of your home. Not only that, but you and your agent should be looking for items that repeatedly come up to make sure any issues are dealt with before they have a negative impact on selling your home. As you can tell, there are a few things you'll need to take into consideration if you're trying to figure out why your home isn't selling. Make sure that your home is in good repair, properly staged, priced correctly, and aggressively marketed, and that you're utilizing a real estate feedback system to collect the opinions of your buyers to look for clues. That way your home will have the best chance of being sold. If you have any questions or just want to talk about the real estate market, even if you're not ready to buy or sell right now, don't hesitate to give me a call or shoot me an email or text. It's not just about selling homes for me. I'm always happy to help in any way that I can. And remember, together we can make it happen.